can't wait to see Mac back in action here with the Black Bears. His presence is always felt on the ice, and I'm sure Kirkby has a pass in front. They score! Scott Ramakers! Binghamton striking early here in period number one. Beautiful play right in front for Ramakers. Gets his first professional goal, and doing this all while still getting a degree is impressive, Brooks, nonetheless. A Good master's, for him. A master's a degree master as well. Stays four on four for the time being. We got 35 more seconds of it. Gates over to Weber, a heavy one-timer. Knocks in his own rebound. Dan Weber with goals in back-to-back -back games. And Binghamton up by a pair early. Well, Dan Weber jumping up in the play like these defensemen are told to do. Just follows his rebound and smacks it past Sammy Bernard, who's had a rude welcoming to this game as now the Black Bears double their lead. Four on four is definitely one of their strong suits, Brooks. Skates in, doesn't like what he sees, plays it back to the line for Powell. Coming in, a wrist shot, tipped on, Peavy. Kicked out by Mack and Animob. Dumas, one on one with Fitzgerald. Easily detected on the wrist shot by Mack and Animob. And here, hang on. Powell at the line, holding. Shot from the faceoff, Stott. Mackinanamog catches it. Anderson, power move to the front of the net. Penalty coming up against Elmira. Fitzgerald, nice thick handle. Backhand, scores! Colin Fitzgerald. What a deep, what a move. And the Black Bears up by three. Well, have yourself a coming home weekend, Fitzy. A homecoming here to Binghamton. He puts two goals in his last two games. And the Black Bears rip-roaring offense that we saw Friday night and Saturday seems to be back in action tonight, Brooks. Elmira now starting the rush from their own end. Wilson up to Parker. Dumas comes powering in, fought off by Mackinanamaw. Loose puck, it's underneath the goalie. And Mackinanamaw stands tall. Look out, here comes Elmira Newman coming in. Smith caught up, a shot, and a save made by Mackinanamaw. And out comes Klink on a big stretch pass. Again, one-on-one -on -one with Liam Anderson, kicked out by Mack and Anima. Elmira passing it around, Powell throws it towards the net. It's tipped on in post-to-post, -post. Mack and Anima being in the right spot. Two-on-one developing Klink, a one-timer, toe save Mack and Anima. Excellent stop on the power play. Face-off win, tries to go through the five-hole of Vecchi. He had the paddle down, maybe knowing that shot was coming. Now, second opportunity for Thompson, and he scores. Austin Thompson continues his scoring streak. That's his 21st of the season, and the Black Bears lead by four, and everybody's going home satisfied. Burger King burger goal for the third straight night in a row here at home. And Austin Thompson stays hot. He's been scorching this weekend since, uh, I think it was last weekend to know Myra, Austin Thompson with eight goals in his last four games, Brooks, if I'm correct. And they just can't connect. Two on one coming back the other way. Somero with Bond. A shot. He scores. Justin Somero. His sixth of the season. Binghamton scoring twice in the final two minutes of the period. Black Bears lead 5-0. And there's the flags waving everyone up here in excitement on a St. Paddy's Day evening. The Black Bears continue their streak of scorching hot hockey as it's a 5-0 lead. And Brooks, 24 goals in the last 72 hours. Take a bow, Binghamton Black Bears. Power play for the Black Bears. This is their fifth of the night. Kirkby holding tipped. Andrew Logar in the bumper, his 10th power play goal of the season. And Binghamton leads by six. Well, the tip plays have been working for the Black Bears. We saw it a whole bunch last night, and now we see it here tonight. Andrew Logar gets himself a piece of that puck under the legs of Sam Lovecci. And the Black Bears extend their lead. It's six nothing here in the 6.07. by a couple of River Sharks. 
Just so couldn't hold it in, and now Binghamton's looking for more. Here comes Stefan, a shot through the five hole, scores! Kyle Stefan, the extra point is good. Black Bears lead 7-0 here at home. Well, Brooks, what a weekend for the Binghamton Black Bears. Up to 26 goals in 72 hours, three games. And the latest, Kyle Steffen, the Black Bears lead at 7-0 here. And I was like, what is the sound? Jesso shot denied by Mack and Animal from Jesso. Binghamton exits the zone. Here come the Black Bears shorthanded. Fitzgerald dropping it back for Smith. No, Romickers, his second of the night. Binghamton shorthanded goals, back-to-back -back nights. Eight nothing, Black Bears. Well, I don't know what was said in that timeout from Elmira, but I don't think that was it as Scott Romickers collects his second of the night. Second of his pro career, a beautiful pass from Colin Fitzgerald. Well deserving of that assist. He should almost get two points for how beautiful that pass was. And now the Black Bears lead eight nothing, Brooks. Another onslaught performance on what's been a picture perfect weekend. Tonight, the Bear jerseys. Blink holds for a shot. Little drag move. Mack and Animal are ready for it. Newman crossing over, trying to get through Stone. Loose puck, Peavy put it on. Mack and Animal made the save. Ends up down near the goal line. Horn's gonna sound. And the Black Bears, complete domination this weekend over both of their opponents. 9-1 yeah. Friday night, 10-0 last night, and 8-1 here against Elmira tonight.